Alright, uh, today we're going to be showing how to install the Jaw 2 Tracer Arm on your 3D Pro Extreme S machine. So, you should be receiving a bag, and within the bag, this is what the contents are. You should have a tracer arm, the tracer knob, a couple of bearings, and a ring. Make sure you don't lose any of the bearings or any of these pieces. It will all be important in installing it. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is take an Allen set. Here's the size of it. You want 5 by 32 inch Allen set tool. We're going to take this cutter brush off, so it should come right off. We're going to set these rings to the side. Take the cutter brush off. Now, we're going to take the cutter wheel off. You want to put your half inch wrench on this side. And now this is reverse nut, so it's going to be righty loosey. So you want to turn it to the right. Yeah. All right, so righty Lucy, get that nut off and get this cutter wheel off. It helps to turn the spindle and pull out at the same time. All right, so once we got that off. We're going to want to lay the machine on the side so clear some space. Okay, so what you're wanting to look at is this spring within the plastic darling. We're going to grab one of these ball bearings and we're going to lay it on top of that spring. So once you get it on top of the spring, you want to get, grab your tracer arm and we're lay it right on top. Show them the difference between the sides. Okay. You want to make sure the notches right here go downwards facing the ball. So just lay it in right there. We're going to get our ring. We're going to kind of open it up on one side. When you get it open, you want to kind of wrap it around inside there and just bring it all the way around and get it inside the groove. Before you get all the way on there, bet your fingers up. Go okay, so I'm good. And when it goes all the way in, you're going to hear the snap. Okay, so there we go. We have the arm on. Now we just need to take this knob and screw it in. And we do send them an extra ball bearing just in case they lose one. Yes, an extra ball bearing just in case you do lose that one. And that is installing the tracer arm.